You're watching the setup instructions for the ADT water and temperature sensor. In this video, we'll guide you through setting up your smart home security device for the first time. Let's get started. Unpack your ADT water and temperature sensor and make sure you have everything you need from the box. For this setup, you may need a screwdriver or a drill for optional wall mounting. Don't forget to wear protective safety glasses when using your drill. You'll also need the following. A smartphone or tablet, the ADT Plus app, and secure Wi-Fi access. Go ahead and gather what you need. Pause here and we'll pick up right where we left off. Before mounting, consider the best placement for your ADT sensor. This sensor provides two functions. It can detect the presence of water and it can monitor a change in temperature, which may indicate a freeze risk for your pipes. If mounting the device on the wall, you'll secure the sensor with the external extension probe in place using the included tape or screws. If placing the sensor directly on the floor or on a flat surface, you won't need the screws or the external extension probe. Now, log in to your ADT Plus app. Make sure your system is disarmed. Tap Menu, then Devices. Enter your security code if prompted. Tap the plus sign. Select ADT Devices. Tap Sensors and Detectors. Then select Water and Temperature Sensor. Name your sensor in the ADT Plus app. Pro tip, name it after the location where you plan to mount it. Let's get started. Remove the mounting bracket from the sensor by carefully lifting it off. Remove the sensor cover by twisting the front cover clockwise so the lines on the cover and the sensor are aligned. Gently lift the cover off. Hold the battery in place and pull the plastic battery tab from the back of the sensor to power your sensor on. For faster connection, the sensor should be in the same room as the ADT base during this step. Your sensor should start pairing with your base. Once the light on the sensor starts blinking blue, tap Connect. The light will continue to flash while it pairs to the base. You'll get a confirmation screen in the ADT Plus app when the sensor is connected. If you're placing it on the floor, reattach the back cover by aligning the vertical lines on both pieces. Rotate clockwise to align the straight line with the lock icon. For wall mounting, we'll let you know when to put the back cover on. Let's place your sensor directly on the floor. With this method, no tools are necessary. The sensor detects water through the gold probes on the bottom. Place the sensor on the floor in the area to be monitored gold probes facing down. For wall placement, mount the external extension probe first. Remove the plug that covers the USB port on the side of the sensor and place it in the slot near the battery. Go ahead and put the back cover on the sensor. Then insert the extension probe into the port on the side of the sensor. Before mounting the probe, verify that it can detect water by touching the prongs with a damp napkin you should hear a beep at the base. Keep the prongs level and position them so that they're just above, but not touching, the surface to be monitored. Use the included tape to secure the probe to the wall. Press firmly in place for 30 seconds. Or, if you prefer, use the provided wall anchor and screw to mount it to the wall. Mark the location and height where you plan to install the bracket. Drill pilot holes if necessary. Use a screwdriver and the provided anchors and screws to secure the bracket in place, making sure the ADT logo is right side up. Then, slide the sensor into the mounting bracket and feed the probe cord through the cutout at the bottom. If you want the sensor to detect temperature changes, you'll first need to create a rule for this in the ADT Plus app. Congratulations, you're all set you can start adding your additional ADT smart home security devices right away. Need more help? Visit the ADT Support Center at help.adt.com 
for more information about your ADT smart home security devices and system, or to chat with an agent.